Uh, take a look at this uh, new show that is coming out on ABC. Let's talk about this stack. We've got crustaceans that will claw you, oysters that you might want to stay the shuck away from, <laughs> and fish that could tank the whole tower. And at the top, we got our drunk octopus ready <laughs> to fall on the loser's heads. And I hear his name is Augie. Augie, yeah, how you doing? I'm Augie. How are you? <laughs> That's not Fred at all. <laughs> From NFL legend Peyton Manning, a larger-than-life competition series, the final straw is about to air right here on ABC, and we have the host and comedian Janelle James with us today. Thank you, Janelle, for coming on the show. Thank you for having me. Oh, my goodness, Natalie. I don't know about you, but I love a good game show, and this looks like Jenga a little bit, Janelle, but can you kind of guide us through the whole idea behind having – anything just random items on the stacks, right <laughs> i mean well it is it's it's not quite random each stack has a theme so we have like uh the wedding stack the baby stack and then everything that's in the in the tower represents that that particular theme but like you said it is like that uh it is similar to that thing you, that game that you said oh, oh, in oh, that oh. the teams <laughs> the teams go to these uh stacks and they pull out the items and the whole objective is to not let these things fall over and when i'm saying these things i'm talking about 16 foot towers full of stuff <laughs> so it's it's wild <laughs> they are definitely intense in this physical game we're taking another look at some clips of course and i what is it like four teams kind of break it down janelle so we know what yes. to expect and how we can actually root along for some of these teams and, and maybe even pick our favorites yeah it's uh four teams and so they play tournament style they go head to head three stacks up top and then they go and then the final team that's left goes to what's called the mega stack which is where you can win the grand prize which is a quarter of a million dollars which is wow. is a lot of money and um yeah and and because these people the the, the teams that we've chosen are close they're best friends they're husband and wife and, and and you know uh co-workers so it's been my favorite part of hosting this game show has been watching like people's relationships disintegrate <laughs> in real time when it's time to, <laughs> to get to this money because it, it gets very tense you know? i can just see it telling a husband no don't pick yes. that one i told you exactly not to pick that one. exactly right. and does he listen you must tune in to find out who knows <laughs> do husbands <laughs> listen you'll find out on this show <laughs> Pretty sure they don't listen to each other. But Janelle, tell us about working with Peyton Manning. I mean, he created essentially the idea behind this this game show. Tell me about what did you have any input as well as a host and you know comedian too? Yeah, I mean, well, no, that's exciting. It was exciting to work with Peyton Manning because I am not a sports fan. I had uh, <laughs> when I met him, I had no idea who he was. But <laughs> so that was funny. But as far as my input, yeah, uh, one of the reasons I wanted to uh, get involved in this show is that when they approached me, they they assured me that a lot of my own personality as a comedian and my uh, jokes would be involved. And so, yeah, it's, it's a lot of Janelle in the show, and I hope everyone enjoys. <laughs> Speaking of a lot of Janelle, uh, you know, getting to know your work and even just listening into some of your previous interviews before you joined us, you have such an infectious laugh mm -hmm. that I just oh, have boy. To smile. I love it. And, and I love your smile and I love your sense of humor. What makes you laugh, though, Janelle? Oh, man, I kind of <laughs> laugh too much. Everything is hilarious I to me. Uh, I'm, I'm definitely a, a giggler. I giggle. Uh, but what makes me laugh? I mean, hijinks. I'm, 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 a, I'm a, I'm a hijinks uh, person, like most comedians. I just like, uh, uh, like I said, in particular for this show, just watching the relationships between the teammate, the teammates, and the, the arguments and the tenseness of it. It's, it's all hilarious to me. But uh, on this show, one of the good things is most people go home with some money. You might not okay. win oh, the big good. prize, but most people don't go home empty-handed. So it's mm -hmm. me laughing isn't as mean as it seems. <laughs> Oh, you, I like that. I know that now. Got it. That's great. And were you able to help well, the, the teams, uh, you know, tell maybe yeah. point at any items that perhaps 
maybe falling. I can't asleep. because I can't because once you once you give one team a pointer, then the other team thinks you have a favorite. So I'm really there to make fun of them, which yeah. is my favorite. <laughs> I'm, I'm gentle ribbing. You had to be looking. Yeah. Oh, don't pick that. No, I feel like that's what we're going to get as viewers. Again, this is going to premiere July Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely, that's what's happening in my head the whole time, but I can't say it out loud. Yeah. I'm going to think of you, Janelle, and I'm watching, yes. knowing what's going in your head now. <laughs> Thanks for being with us. Thank you, Janelle. Thank you so much. Thank you. And the final straw is actually airing this Sunday, July 10th, 9 o'clock, right here on ABC.